Hello, my name's Alicia. I'm in Nursing 4600, and today I want to give talk to you about a case study. Um, but first, I'm going to give you a little background about a Moab Regional Hospital's partnership with the University of Utah's Telestroke program. This has been going on since 2003, um, and. Moab Regional Hospital is a level four trauma center. And what that means is that they, we, they accept um, patients for stabilization evaluation, patients such as traumatic injuries, um, cardiac arrest, and stroke. And today we're talking about the Telestroke program. We're gonna focus on a case study happened in 2020. A young man named Mark, he's 36 years old. Um, he uh, was interviewed up at the U of U, and there's an article about him um, in their, on their website. But Mark uh, is a young, healthy guy, um, very athletic, avid cyclist. He had a uh, cross-country bicycle over three times, so he's in amazing shape. Um, visiting Moab as a tourist from Texas um, for a wedding at Arches National Park, one of our beautiful parks here. And he had some downtime with his family at the hotel, swimming with the kids, and uh, he was suddenly struck with some um, horrible symptoms of lightheadedness, dizziness. He couldn't talk, couldn't walk. He had to, um, you know, get pulled out of that pool, and uh, he wasn't able to walk. But these symptoms came and went, so it was kind of like a phasing in and out of intense symptoms here. But he wasn't sure what to do. Um, and uh, after a bit of time, his family decided to bring him into the ER here at Moab Regional Hospital. The physician um, provider at the ER uh, called the, um, tel the um, neurologist up at the U of U, and they did a consultation. And the neurologist said, yes, Mark's definitely a candidate for telestroke. Let's get him hooked up. Did the evaluation on Mark, did a visual audio, and... Uh, uh, evaluation along with a CT and MRI, MRI scan and determined that Mark had an ischemic stroke but the time frame was just too long to treat him. It had been, it had been over three hours so he was out of that window. So they had to look for other treatments and they just determined that a um, thromboectomy was the best course of action and he needed a helicopter ride um, from Moab Regional to the U of U, 233 miles away. So here I'm standing at the helipad and this is where Mark was helicoptered out of, uh, the, uh, the Moab Regional Hospital telepad. And about um, 50 yards away is the ER. So Mark was hurried from west away from Moab Regional Hospital's uh, ER to the helipad, flown over to the U, had the thromboectomy, and literally immediately had a resolving um, of the symptoms and was able to walk, talk, and smile again. So it was a very positive outcome. It saved his life. And um, so this is an example of a positive outcome and a case study. Thanks.